is Harry and welcome back to Pac Mania. Okay, so sadly as you know, no intro today, I couldn't be bothered, but now um update on Sky Blog or Sky Blog, oh yay. So as you can see this is Bryn's house. I'm doing a tour today. So here's Bryn's house. Then you've got this sort of infinite water source, which is quite cool. Then you've got Luke's um, and Rio's house, storage room. And then in here, you've got all their stuff, useless stuff. And then here again, you've got useless stuff. Then Luke's armor standard diamond armor one, but he moved it into the shop, which is currently over here. Um, yeah, the farm has changed a load. It's been ordered now, so you've got the sugar cane bits all scattered over the place. It's still yet to be expanded. We added in a tree farm, that was a big thing. And in the hub, we've got a private chest which holds some beautiful stuff. We got some music discs. Um, when and the way we got them was by using a mug spawner. Um, if you want me to come and show you, um. It's over here. So let's keep going, and as you can see, it's already in attention. And here is where all the mob loot goes like the gunpowder, even more gunpowder, the string. The string is used to make wool, basically. And our ways we get bone mill so quick because basically we've got a trapdoor, so you'd hit them through the trapdoor. It is so much more easier. <clears throat> it's probably my favourite way. Um, as you can see, the inventories are very empty on, on me. It's because we came to a decision, all of us, that we're not going to wear our OP armour because we've died with so much OP armour on. It's just so rubbish um, how bad we are. Basically, the only times are you don't use your OP armour. Now, as you may have seen, our new hot tub yes um no addition to the world now let me show you the way the mob spawner works is basically you get crowds of mobs just coming at you and it's like this it's just amazing how well it's got but it's so hard to kill them all see there's still piles of ecstatic mobs coming And as you can see, judging by how packed it is. And here you see you've got stuff like witches which come in later, which are the pain there. And then you see you let the creeper go off, which kills them all. Oh, flip, we've got a witch. So as you can see, that was our successful mob spawner. Go off. And as you can see, still successful. But we've had quite a lot of difficulties in there. As you can see, everyone keeps dying. There was like 50 levels. But we we don't care if we lose stuff because basically Luke accidentally did say just I disobeyed him. He did say just use stone swords against them. I used harder swords. I don't know why. It was just a better option for me. It it benefited me more than it benefits Luke. You need to have something that benefits the person. You need to have something that benefits you over your friends. Because your benefit is more important than your friend's benefit. So it's always do what's best for you than do what's best for your friends. That's what I've always learned. And then you see, we've got lots of security to make sure they're definitely not going to get through. And it's very unlikely they're going to get through that. A trap door. <coughs> And they can't walk on slabs that well, which is the whole island is made of. Ah, oh, damn. Spider, spider, spider. Die! Ugh. And then you see, this stuff goes over to another chest we've got. 
which is basically what we call mob chest. It's basically you get all your mob resources and stuff to work together um, to come in here. But then you see when you've got something I like to make, um, let's say, a block of wool, you get rid of all that and that just goes back in there. <coughs> And then you see we're going to go back to the other place. Guys, Ben got a cam recorder, yay. But this is probably going to be one of the only videos out today. We have room set 5-ish. 4 Yes. Um, so then you can see in here goes the wall. 21 wall. And basically, I haven't showed you the food shop yet, but it's still not fully updated yet. The food shop something really useful. It's basically just a shop in general where we sell stuff. It's really good to get items. It's probably the best way we get items. Is basically like we can, we sell them like, it's just the way that like, is sort of we all have jobs. Although like you can't go off and get this stuff like music discs. You can sell to people for like instance, 35 wood equals... Um, like 35 wood will get you a stack of lemons but you know it takes the resource collecting then we can go into the selling process and you see we've got the two glass bottles we've got the music discs now the music discs are going to be quite expensive they're going to be roughly two um a stack of cobblestone just because it's just they're expensive and then you see, anyone can give me an enchanted pickaxe. Now, I don't really think the hub ne this needs to be on. Because another time when I did a video, the chat basically was really rude. They swore, they were swearing and stuff. So, done. It's on command only, so we shouldn't get any more chat stuff. <coughs> so, if we just get a stone sword and jump straight into the mob spanner, I'll be right back once I've got some drops and some XP. They have been very rude, haven't you? Yes. Disrespectful to me and my friends. And a button's broken right now on the Mac, and now it's working, it's just lag. They've been very disrespectful, haven't they? The way they treated me. Oh, damn! Bro! Slash home well at least they won't be able to get far past and they'll just burn off the creepers and do stuff like that you see they're they're probably gonna think oh we can walk past that easily but actually they can't because the door is ungettable end of story um <laughs> so basically we did a bit of playing around without you guys um, well, I did, and I got some stuff like gunpowder. Now, the bow is increasing how many we are getting through drops, but sadly, the more it increases, the more bows, um, the more damage, depends on how well the skeleton's done in its life cycle. So, like, the skeleton always dies, so we get nothing out of the skeletons, um, <coughs> which is super mean, you know? Like, it's just not, skeletons aren't my favourite. They're my least favourite, because I don't like skeletons. Because, like, and I do really, I'm not, I, I actually, I am extremely looking forward to this stuff in 1.9. Because in 1.9 today they did a new snapshot, and I believe in that snapshot, it had some cool stuff, like, um, some really super cool stuff which um, I saw, and basically the cool stuff was stuff like, um, it was this new type of skeleton, was riding a skeleton horse, <coughs> and also there's going to be dual wielding and stuff, which will be super fun for the videos, like, dual wielding, yay, it will be super fun. Um, so yeah, we we got big hopes for this place. 
<coughs> I mean, I make it look nice and big. I'm the only one, and Luke, we're the only ones currently working. Bryn said hopefully he'll be on today. I doubt he will, because he said around five-ish, maybe half four. And if he's not, I said he'd wake up with a glass to his face. So, yeah. I'm being, I'm being kind. But as you can see, like, this whole thing's working out well. I mean, we've got all this stuff. Now, no, I haven't had, no one's voted yet. No one's decided to vote. I, if you don't know what I was talking about, I basically asked if, does anyone up for um, deciding maybe what pack they want to use? Do you want the default or do you want um, the one that I normally use, the Spax texture pack? Or do you want a new one? I don't, I'm probably going to stick. There's going to be, there's only going to be those two options. No other big ones, you know, because it just came to that point where I can't. I just can't give away my stuff. And it is, it's like, it's so hard because I'm, I crashed my game once. Uh, 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 uh. There you go. <laughs> I know I'm a bit of a cheat. I took the hero armor and replaced it with rubbish armor. But this hero armor is going to last forever. See? Cover your feet. These hero armor lasts for hours. Um, Hero pickaxe. And then I had the premium sword, which of course you all know I did lost. Now, some of you do know, how come Luke can survive longer than me? I know it's awkward. He's like, <coughs> he could survive the best of an hour. I, can, I can't even survive that long. Right. Let's keep looking, let's keep looking, let's keep looking. Glitch. 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 So you see, I'm the one who, I focus on the farm more than I focus on my own house in this thing. Which I think is pretty unfair. How I focus on the house more than I focus on my own. Well no, I don't focus on the house, really. I focus on the world well then focus on me right someone just came on skype i'll be right well it's my friend because he's got a phone and he always uses the um like phone when he turns it off and off on and off and on when it goes off it indicates him as um off basically when he goes off his phone when he comes on his phone it indicates him as on his phone it's very complicated you one minute guys. Alright guys, we are back. It's like an hour's difference in time. So if you had bang, it was me basically just I remembered it. I got to close my door. And some stuff had grown when I was gone. Extra canes growing, some more lemons. No pumpkins yet. So dumb. And I'm hoping to do a video of Rambo at around half five. If they're not on, I'll be super angry. So yeah. Lock that. Yes. What? Hello old holy lady. Finish me off. Do do it, please. I may love you too, but I need to push up the edge first. How are they getting through? Wait, witches shouldn't be spawning here. They can have got through because that's broke. That's locked. They've got five bits of security to get through. Did you fail me, Mr. Soldier Man? You failed me. You fell out of me, guys. Right. 
Yeah, we can eat food. 